going to argue it's one of the most exciting and anticipated events of the year in Detroit, the Ford fireworks, and we are just two days away. So much work goes into making the fireworks show a success. Nick Monticelli taking us behind the scenes to see how it all works and what's new this year. I don't know about you guys, but I love behind the scenes type of stuff. And this is as close to the Ford fireworks as we could possibly get. The crew from Zambelli Fireworks is loading the show as we speak. And what's really interesting is to hear the choreographer say how much work goes into it before this even begins. It's 24 minutes and a few seconds long. Down to the second. Oh yeah, we program in the millisecond. Patrick Brawl is the choreographer for the Ford Fireworks, and no one knows the show better than him. For months, he has been designing and programming. He starts when he gets the music. So I put myself, imagine myself on top of the rooftop and watch the three barges. I close my eyes, listen to the music, and I write down what I see. That process takes a while, almost 100 hours just to design the show. Then weeks of programming the computers, another week to load the trucks, and then one more week to set up the show. It's all controlled by computers, sending electronic signals timed with the music. They make sure it's as perfect as possible. Don't forget, this is fireworks, this is powder burning, so there's an inherent error margin that you can't control. This year's show, themed Go Forward Detroit, will have 11,000 shells exploding in the air coming from three different barges. And new this year, something called a ghost shell which you do not see go off. But no, it opens in the dark, and then the color appears in a circular fashion. It sweeps around. As you can imagine, there's a lot of anxiety and anticipation when the actual show is happening. Then comes the grand finale, and then it's over. Oh, it's a drop of adrenaline. So I go, oh, hey, uh, <laughs> now I need a drink. <laughs> in Detroit, Nick Monticelli, Local Fool. You can have a drink Monday night at about 11 o'clock. Then you exactly. can relax and have a drink. <laughs> you pay attention now. Uh, also new this year is free parking on Belle Isle. The first 1,000 vehicles oh. onto the island absolutely free. You get a free state recreation passport, which can be used the rest of the year. And Local 4 is, of course, your home for the Ford fireworks. We're going to have a special broadcast. That special broadcast is coming up Monday at 7. We'll then take a little break for the Olympic trials and be back on air at 9 for a live coverage of the fireworks show. It's all coming up on Monday night right here on Local 4.